What's up, everybody? I'm your host, Brian Watkins, and welcome to another edition of the Brian Watkins channel. My subject today is fellas. Now, I don't know how it is in your city, in your state, but over here in the Midwest, just women, no matter what color they are, female, no matter what color they are, man, they be tripping. Like, oh, this is why I enjoy being single. Um, you don't have to do nothing wrong to get in trouble by them. You really don't. The reason why I'm making this video is, do you agree with it? Is it that way in your city and state? If so, let's get started. Now, me personally, I don't chase women. It's, it's just not me. They want you to go through all these little stupid little changes for them. Like, for instance, uh, how, how do I know a girl's supposed to like me? I mean, okay, they walk by, they speak to you. I've seen the guys get their feelings hurt. They think that a girl will speak to them. It could be just out of common courtesy or she might want to talk to you. I don't know. I personally really don't care. Um, and they turn around and try to talk to her. She's like, <laughs> she flip on them. Excuse me? What did you say to me? You're like, oh, well, I thought when you spoke to me, I say no. See, that's the problem with you guys. You always are thinking below your waist with your little head. It's like, I was just, I, I didn't know. So with me, I don't give a damn personally. So they look at me as an asshole. And I, and I was just sitting here putting together what I was going to uh, talk about, you know, today on the show with my viewers and whatnot. And I turned around and looked up. I, she had been down there for like 10 minutes. I had kind of thought it was her. I was like, oh, I can't be her. Maybe, maybe, maybe she just, just might look like her. Anyway, make a long story short, I was drinking me some water and I happened to drop it. And I was watching Eddie Griffin. <laughs> One of his comedy shows, so I was laughing at my headphones on and stuff. And I just happened to look after I knocked my water over. And out of common courtesy, I'm like, oh, I didn't know that that. And by the time I had said that, she got up from the couch and looked and rolled her eyes and stormed and walked away. And I'm just like, see, that's why I like being single. Now, don't get me wrong. I don't mind getting together and touching up that pussy on them. But that's pretty much about it. I learned all the changes they want you to go through. Mm -mm, hell with all that. Live in the damn moment with them. And that's pretty much about it. Because if not, they get, you're going to lose your mind. You don't have to do nothing wrong for these women to get upset with you. You could be um, sitting there and join one of your favorite shows. You know, she might be talking. It's like a honey could... Oh, Oh, so you want me to be why, why, why you enjoy your show? Uh, you want me to lie? You want me to tell you the truth? Come on, come tell me the truth. Tell me what's in your heart. Okay, could you be quiet? Oh, you in the doghouse. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you don't got to do nothing wrong. And I'm in trouble every day with, uh, with women and females on just pretty much, pretty much, because it's all about me. It's not about them. It's all about Uno. Number one. One, 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 one. So they like, you are extremely suck on yourself. I know. Because getting wrapped up with them, you, I, over here, you, man, I've seen fellas go from being really nice guys to being nuts, starting fights with themselves. That's right, you heard me. Starting fights with themselves over there talking to a street pole all over women and females because they want you to go through all these little rinky dinky little changes that you supposed to just know i'm like i'm not doing this shit. i ain't i'm gonna freak it in you know, oh and man when they see me again the eyes turn into slits there he is there's that asshole and I, just, I, it's that's the thing i've been and forgot about him like i said i don't spend that old <laughs> Fix her. I'll just come back here next week and I'll sit and wait for her and let her know I don't like. I don't do stuff like that. Whereas women do. At least over here they do. Like I said, fellas, correct me if I'm wrong. I, let me know how women and females behave in your city and state. I want to know because over here, I, my ass is in trouble every damn second with them. Now, girl, see, but the problem is, you know, he's stuck up for real. Oh, okay, I'm, I'm not stuck up. 
Oh, so I'm considered stuck up because of the fact I'm not trying to sweat you and no. Uh, oh, what is she thinking? What I'm like, I'm not gonna do it. I don't want to be bothered with you. You know, I'm not interested. And it's really sad because a guy doesn't have to do anything wrong to get in trouble with a woman today. He doesn't. He could be just studying. You know, say he's in college and he has finals. You know. She don't care that he's studying for finals, you know, he's trying to finish college or whatever. You know, she said, well, come on, I want to go to the movies. I'm like, I remember I uh, told you that I got finals and all stuff. So that, I, I'm taking it, that's a no. <laughs> of course, it's into the no. <laughs> no. Oh, okay. <laughs> you know, you're going to pay for this. They're just, they're just nuts. And it's really sad because they make it bad for a woman that is all right. I'm telling you. Brothers, I'm serious. I met a woman two weeks ago. We had a good time. She turned on me the next day. Didn't do nothing wrong. Met another one. Like Lionel Richie said on that song, I'm looking for a good time. Good time. Whoa, sail on. Right? She flipped the script on me and just went all off on me. Then another one. We so called hit it off. No, we actually hit it off. Turn to me. This was last night. This is another one. She looked fine, too. All right, again. She came into Dunkin' Donuts. It was about. Two more brothers in there. They knew each other. So they was talking, laughing, cussing, and everything. And uh, I was sitting at the window. I just got me some, got me some donuts. And I was sitting back again, figuring out what I was going to talk about uh, on my show. And uh, so, I'm, you know, you see the reflection of the glass of who's behind you. And I look back, and she's looking. What in the hell does he think he is? Ignoring me. I wasn't ignoring her. She was talking to the brothers because she was like, oh, why is it so hot in here? And it was like the air conditioner is down. She asked the server, do they have uh, cookie dough ice cream and some other little sprinkling toppings? And he was like, yeah. yeah. So I was just sitting there like, hmm, I wonder what subject am I going to discuss? How I'm going to discuss it and blah, blah, blah. And I just happened to keep glancing up at the window reflection. She's still looking at me like, I said, man, and I had to learn the hard way, you know, that I came to conclusions that, man, no matter what you say or do, you're going to piss them off, okay, because I'm not dependent on them, you know, whether they want to give me some attention or not, I don't care, because I know they're fickle, I know they kind of act a little dingy, and women, females, they like drama, you know, so when you mix all that together, something has to go wrong. So, unfortunately, I'm like, you know what? I don't agree with any of that, but that she is an individual and she is entitled to participate in what brings her mind the most satisfaction. So, I know already pretty much is like, well, man, just stay single, you know, don't get married and please don't have any kids. Don't get engaged. You know, y'all can still fuck. Okay. You know, live in the moment. See, that's the beauty of being with the woman. It's living in that moment. Ah, you know, and you'll have some fun. It's social and have a good time and try to get a kiss in if you can. Because I don't know about y'all, brothers, but my ass is in trouble the next damn day or a couple hours later. I don't even know what I did. And I admit I don't try to figure out what I said or did because I'm like, okay, I had a good time, showed up. If she felt something was wrong with me, we wouldn't have got this far. You know, but again, I learned that I don't do all that. You know, well, what's wrong, baby? And you know, why? And what did I do? And I'm like, I haven't did anything. I'm like, oh, oh, oh. I know they get upset because they always say that I put myself before them. Well, hey, I told you it's all about me. So, fellas, please state your comments. I need to know because I'm in trouble. I mean, I'm 47 years old. I'm in trouble with women and females. Every day, different ones. 
And some of them be real fine. Finer than Rihanna, Beyonce, Alicia Keys. They be bad. They looking at me like, I'm going to whoop your ass. I'm like, hmm. I've been forgot about them. Because, fuck, brothers. It's a lot of fine women on this planet. It's an old saying. Took me a while to understand it. It's an old saying. You see a pretty woman walking down the street, turn the corner, you you, you see five more that's better that look way better than her. It's true. So I admit I'd be oh well just like this one that just flipped out on me. I'm like okay, I right, roll down to something wrong with her, you know, because again they want you to go through all these changes and go through all these who loops to be with. <laughs> I'm not doing that. You know, so usually like, oh, so you're an asshole. Or, or you know what? You think you're better than everybody. You know, and that's why women don't want to be with you. And that's why you, all these women are going to leave you and so on, so on, so on, so right for not trying to stick my head up your ass to kiss your ass. Oh, well, single I'll be. So, fellas, get back with me. Want to know what you are going through with women and females in your city. And in your state, I'm curious. I just want some new and putting some feedback on this because I'm in trouble every damn second. Don't you go.